Hey fellow tees and parents, today I will provide you with countdown of my favorite pencil grips for children who struggle holding the pencil correctly. Mature pencil grasp will improve sizing, accuracy and speed of writing. Number 10. Keyring. Place your pinky and ring finger inside the keyring and flex it against the palm. The key ring reminds the child to keep the ring and pinky fingers closed against the palm. Number 9. Close pin. Clip it to the shaft of the pencil and secure the close pin against your palm. This grip support prevents a child from forming a fist around the pencil. Number 8. The Sock Use the marker to mark the space for cutting. Use the scissors to cut out your holes. Thread the index and thumb fingers through the holes. The rest of the fingers are resting against the palm. The sock helps the middle ring and pinky finger stay tucked inside the palm. It also allows only thumb and index finger to hold the pencil. Number 7. Binder Clip Open the binder clip and place it securely on the shaft of the pencil. Position your index finger between the clips of the binder. This grip support assists with separation and provides boundaries between the thumb, index and middle fingers. Number 6. Bowl. Any small sized bowl with holes can be used for this method. Push the pencil through the bowl and position it in the web space of your hand. The bowl helps keep your child's thumb and index joints bent. It also provides support and opening of the web space. Number 5. Small or triangular pencils. Due to the length of the pencil, it forces the kids to use the tips of the fingers on the pencil and stops them from using the gross grasp. The three flat sides of the markers makes it a perfect match for mature grasp. Number 4. Built up handle. For this you will need one tissue paper and masking tape. Fold your tissue paper and then roll it around your pencil. Next, use your masking tape on top of the tissue paper until it's completely covered. The built-up handle provides greater support for little fingers. It alleviates some of the pressure on the joints and also can decrease fatigue during continuous writing or coloring. Number 3. Rubber Band Twist it around the pencil until it's completely finished.
the rubber band provides greater surface area and it also prevents the slipping of the fingers down on the pencil. Number 2. Cotton ball. Place the cotton ball on the ulnar side of your hand and cue the ring and pinky fingers to be closed against it. A cotton ball reminds the child to keep the ring and pinky fingers closed against the palm. It provides stability to the ulnar side while writing. And my number one favorite is inspired by Handy Writer. All you need is two hair ties, a 5 inch elastic and a small bead. Lace the elastic through the bead and make two knots. Next, make two knots connecting the elastic to one of the hair ties. Finally, connect two hair ties together and place one of them on your wrist. Close the ring and pinky fingers against the bead and place the pencil inside the loop of the hair tie. The small bead provides cues to keep the ring and pinky fingers curled against the palm. The rubber band pulls the pencil at an angle which facilitates the opening of the web space. It also brings the thumb and index finger in flexion for a mature tripod grasp. You can choose a colorful hair ties to make your handy writer more socially acceptable. Keep in mind that choosing the right pencil grip for your child should always involve consultation with occupational therapist. He or she will help you see the origin of the problem and help you correct the grasp. The goal for any grip support is to help child write neatly and for extended period of time and not get tired. Thanks for watching my video. Like and subscribe. Bye.